Jennifer Lopez is a superstar. Born to Puerto Rican parents in the Bronx in 1969, the singer, actress, dancer, and producer grew up to become the first Latino actress to earn a million US dollars for a film. She now commands up to $15 million a picture and made history in 2001 when she became the first ever female artist to have a number one album and a number one movie in the same week. The film was The Wedding Planner, the album, the eponymous J-Lo. Other successful films include Selena, Made in Manhattan, and Out of Sight, where her on-screen chemistry with co-star George Clooney sizzled up the screen. Unfortunately, she also suffered the misfortune of starring in one of the most infamous flops of recent years, 2003's Gili. It was roundly condemned on all sides, collecting seven Razzies for being the worst film of the year, as well as winning the worst on-screen couple and individual worst actor awards for both Ben Affleck and Jennifer. The couple, who were romantically linked at the time, always attracted the full glare of the media spotlight. Dubbed Benefer, they found themselves constantly on the gossip pages during their two-year relationship. But even that wasn't quite as bad as Jennifer's previous relationship. While dating the hip-hop performer Sean Puff Daddy Coombs, she was with him the night his entourage exchanged gunfire with another group. Jennifer and Coombs' car was later chased and then stopped by police. When a stolen gun was found in the front seat, Jennifer was charged with felony gun possession, but the charges were dropped when it was revealed that she was in the back seat of the car. And Affleck and Coombs haven't been her only troublesome relationships. She had to sue her first husband, Ojani Noah, to prevent him from revealing details about their marriage in a tell-all book. And her second marriage to dancer Chris Judd fell apart when she started seeing Affleck. Despite the widespread reports of extravagant demands and diva-like behavior, such as holding auditions for her child's godparents, since her 2004 wedding to longtime friend Mark Antony, life seems to have finally settled down for the woman People magazine labeled the most influential Hispanic entertainer in America.